안녕하십니까? Hello everyone. 아, 우리는 지난번에 그 야이로의 딸에 대한 이야기를 했습니다. Last time we talked about Jairus's daughter. 우리가 똑같은 사건을 똑같은 형편을 봐도 Even though we're looking at the same situation, same circumstances. 사람에 따라 판단이 다르고 All people they have different judgments. 생각이 다릅니다. And all people's thoughts differ. 때문에 대부분 사람들은 자기 생각 옳다고 생각한 생각 강하게 가지고 있으면. And that's why when people who strongly believe that their own thoughts are right. 다른 사람 부딪히는 경우가 많아지고. They often clash with others. 반대로 그 나머지 따라가도 보면은. And on the other hand, when people follow others. 선이 없는 삶을 살게 되는 게 맞. Often people end up just living reckless lives. 중요한 건 우리가 이 신앙의 세계 들어올 때. But the important thing in the world of spiritual life is that. 기독교는 다른 종교들 예수님과 하나님을 믿는 교회이기 때문에. Christianity, it is a church that believes in God. 하나님 생각하고 우리 생각이 다른 건 사실입니다. It is true, God's thoughts and our thoughts are different. 그만큼 하나님의 생각이 모자라고 부족하다는 이야기죠. And it means our thoughts are that much behind God. 그렇기 때문에 우리 우리가 보는 판단하고 한 판단 다르기 때문에 And that's why our own judgment and God's judgment differ. 뭐라고 말하냐면은 So what the Bible says is 여호와의 말씀에 Thus say the Lord. 내 생각 너희 생각과 다르며 My thoughts are not your thoughts. 내 길은 너희 길과 달라서 Neither are your ways my ways. 하늘의 땅보다 높은 같이 And for as the heavens are higher than the earth. 내 길은 너희 길도 높으며 내 생각 너희 생각 높으니라. So are my ways higher than your ways and my thoughts than your thoughts. 그래서 우리가 하나님보다 더 지혜롭다면 왜 하나님 믿습니까? If we were wiser than God, why would we believe in God? 부족하기 때문에 예수님의 은혜를 입고 싶고 하나님의 사랑을 입고 싶은 겁니다. Because we fall short, we want to receive the grace and the love of Jesus. 어떨 때 내가 옳은 것처럼 보이지만은. So sometimes it may appear that you are right. 실제 하나님 말씀 자체가 옳은 것이기 때문에. But actually the word of God is right. 내 생각에 어떠하든 하나님의 말씀과 마음을 맞추어야 하는 것이. So no matter what your thoughts are, you need to fit your heart with the words of God. 우리가 사회에서 그런 친구들로 살 때. Even out in society, when you're getting along with your friends. 많은 친구들 사귀면 되지만은. Make friends with people who your heart gets along with. 하나님은 우리하고 절대적인 존재이기 때문에. However, God is absolute. 우리의 힘으로, 우리의 노력으로 안 되는 일이 다 하나님의 은혜 입어야 하기 때문에. Because things cannot be done with our efforts and our abilities, we need to receive the grace of God. 우리가 아무리 잘해도 하나님보다 뛰어날 수 없으니까. And no matter how well we do, we cannot do better than God. 우리의 지혜를 가지고 우리 지혜를 두고 하나님의 은혜를 입어야 하는가 마음을 같이 해야 한다. That's why we need to leave our wisdom and make our hearts one. With the wisdom and the heart of God. 초등학교 1학년하고 대학교 1학년 생각이 같을 수가 없지요. A first grader and a freshman in college cannot have the same kinds of thoughts. 제 아들도 어릴 때는 생각이 같지 않지요. And when my son, when his thoughts, when he was young, his thoughts were not the same as mine. 아버지 교회 어떤 일이 있어서 one time something happened at my church. 제가 돈을 많이 받아서 가지고. And I was counting some money for the church. And handed it to the brother of the church, saying, "Take care of some things for the church." And my son just stared at that. And what he said was, "Dad, I don't understand you." What do you not understand? 아빠는 돈이 그렇게 많은데 아이스크림 안사 먹고 남 주는 거 이해가 안 간다. Dad, you have so much money, but you don't buy ice cream, and you just gave that money to him. I don't understand you, he said. 어린 아들은 아이스크림 너무 너무 맛있는데. To my young son, the ice cream is so delicious. 그 돈이 그사 먹고 싶은데 그거 안사 먹고 다른 사람 주는 이해가 안 간다. And with his money, he wants to use that for ice cream, and he cannot understand I was giving that money to that brother. 지금 아들이 다 자라서. Now my son is grown. 제 아이 아버지인데. And he is a father of three. 지금도 제 아들이 그렇게 말. And would my son say that even now? No. 그때 내가 지금 저 아버지나 맞다. Back then and now, he is still my son. That remains the same. 즉 하나님하고 우리와 생각이 같을 수가 없고. Likewise, God's thoughts cannot be the same as ours. 같을 수가 없는 겁니다. And our wisdom cannot be same as his. 그래서 우리는 이제 우리 생각 하나님 생각이 다를 때. So when our thoughts differ from the thoughts of God, 우리가 잘못된 하나님 잘못되지는 않았습니다. It is we who is wrong, not God. 전능하신 하나님이시고. Because He is the Almighty God. 우리를 도우시는 분입니다. And He is the one who helps us. 그렇기 때문에 야이로라는 사람이 있었는데. That's why there was this man named Jairus. 이제 그 야이로의 딸이 죽었습니다. And Jairus's daughter had died. 이제 처음에는 다 죽을 때 예수님께 와서. And when she was on the verge of death, he hoped that Jesus would come and save his daughter. 오는 길에 
But on the way, Jesus met the woman with the issue of blood, and that took up some time. And people from his house came and said, Your daughter is dead. Even though Jesus comes, it's pointless. We think that when the daughter is dead, that there is no way. But Jesus is not human. He can raise the dead. He said, Be not afraid, only believe. And Jairus believed the words of Jesus. And he went home. The child was dead. People were weeping. Because his one and only daughter was now dead, people were filled with grief. Right then Jesus said, be not sad. Weep not. The damsel is not dead, but sleepeth. That was what Jesus said. Because these people do not know the power of Jesus, on the inside they laugh. Don't you think we know the difference between dead and sleeping? The dead has no breath. The sleeping breathe and their body is warm. 알지요. We know the difference. But surely this girl is dead. Their own thoughts were right. And according to their own standard, Jesus, rather than the thoughts of Jesus, they themselves seemed more right. The girl was dead. But Jesus is on a different level from them. In our eyes, she may look dead, but if Jesus says she's alive, she's alive. And many things look impossible in our eyes, which is possible to God's eyes. The reason I believe in Jesus is, as I've lived life until now, there were many big and small things that I had faced. And humanistically, they were completely impossible. But so many of them were achieved through Jesus. From then on, after after I got to believe in Jesus, believe in the Word, there were so many things that I asked of Jesus which were humanly impossible that became achieved through Jesus. So I began to read the Bible. And when I read the Bible, the thoughts of Jesus and our thoughts are completely different. And when my thoughts are different from the thoughts of Jesus, then are my thoughts right? or the thoughts of Jesus right? I can't even create even one small thing. But Jesus created the universe. He created the heaven and the earth. He created life. I cannot compare with him. But as I read the Bible and discovered God in the Bible and I saw his wisdom and heard his words and came to know his power. And he was someone I could not compare with. If I become one with him, if I gain his wisdom, if he helps me, even though I'm poor, I could be blessed. I can be happy. From then on, I threw away everything that I knew and began to accept the words of Jesus. And sometimes there were things that I understood. But there were times when I did not understand. Even so, I decided to believe in him. The amazing thing is that's what all I did, decided to do that in my heart. And there were many things that seemed impossible in front of me. But according to the words of the Bible, when I believed and relied on Jesus, so many things were achieved. So when we get to have the faith to believe in Jesus, we must throw away our humanistic thoughts and accept the words of Jesus. Why? Because our thoughts are not the same as the thoughts of Jesus. It is the word of God which is not which is right, not my words. Surely I committed sin. I told many lies. I committed lots of thefts. I'm a terrible sinner. That's right. That's right, I'm a sinner. But what does the Bible say? 
It says that Jesus says he justified us. No way. We committed sins. We've done evil. How could we be justified? We're sinners. It sounds like nonsense. But when we read the Bible, Jesus came for our sins. And he was crucified and he died. He took the place of our sins. And he received all the punishment for sins we were to receive. Therefore, even though we sinned, through the cross of Jesus, he has justified us. And because I committed sins, people who think that they are sinners because of that, they cannot accept the righteousness of Jesus. You committed sins, you're a sinner, but but Jesus came to this earth was crucified and punished for all your sins therefore he has made you righteous, clean and holy oh then that's right I am righteous even though I've sinned Jesus forgave all my sins he received all the punishment for my sins at the cross even though many people go to church they think that because they've committed sins that they're sinners. That's right, if you commit sins, you're a sinner. But, for example, when my son was studying in America, he needed a room to stay in. And suppose I got a room where he paid monthly rent. So each month he needs to pay rent. But if I paid off one year's worth of rent for him, then he doesn't have to pay the rent for that year. But if I buy that house for him, he doesn't have to pay anything ever again. So depending on what I do for him, it will determine whether my son pays rent or not. If I don't pay the rent for my son, he's not going to be able to pay rent, he's going to struggle. Even though he pays no rent, if I buy that house for him and let him use it, he'll be free. So my son needs to pay rent, but if I buy that whole house for him, my son doesn't have to pay anything. He doesn't have to pay any rent. Likewise, even though we've done wrong, if Jesus forgave all our sins, if he was punished for all our sins, then we are holy and we are righteous. Many people who go to church today don't read the Bible. And even though Jesus was crucified for all of our sins, but still so many people say that they're sinners. That is what the problem is. So many people say that they're sinners. But God sent Jesus to forgive our sins. He carried our sins and if he received all the punishment for our sins, then that's right, we are righteous and we are holy. In Romans chapter 3 verse 24, being justified freely by His grace. Being justified freely by His grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. We have committed sins, but we have been justified. When I was a student, in school when I needed a notebook or a pencil, I would tell my father, I need to buy a notebook. And my father's friend, friend ran a stationery shop. And I would tell him, my father's going to pay you. He's all going to take it. I told him, my father said, I can pick up a pencil here. I would tell him. Oh, what do you need? Oh, that one? Yeah, it costs this much. And then he would say, I would tell my father, I need a notepad. Oh, yeah, I paid that off for you last time. And actually, I paid a little more so that you can buy whatever you need. You have credit, so, so just get whatever you need. My father already paid credit. 
비친 게 아닌 거지. Even though I take a notepad or a pencil, I'm okay. 우리 죄의 벌을 다벌 받았기 때문에. Likewise, Jesus received all the punishment for our sins. 우리가 연필을 가져가도 노트를 가져 비친 게 아닌 것처럼. Even though I take the pencil or notepad, I don't owe him anything. 우리가 죄를 지었지만. Even though we have committed sins. 악을 행하였지만. Even though we've done evil. 수하지만. Even though we're filthy. 온전하게 되었다는 것이. He has perfected us. 그게 너무 너무 놀라운 사실. That's what's so amazing. 그게 자기 생각 속에 있는 사람들. But people who are inside of their own thoughts. 자기 판단을 가지고 보는 거죠. They look with their own judgment. 내가 죄를 지으면. If I commit sins. 죄인입니다. Then I'm a sinner. 죄를 안 지으면. If I don't commit sins. 죄인이 아닙니다. I am not a sinner. 내가 죄를 지었지만. Even though I've sinned. 예수님 내 죄의 벌을 다 불받았으면. If Jesus received all the punishment for my sins. 난 죄인이에요 아니에요. Then am I a sinner or not? 아니죠. I am not. 그기 때문에 예수 우리 죄를 다 불받았기 때문에. And that's right because Jesus received all the punishment for my sins. 의롭다고 하신 거예요. He says I am righteous. 그러니까 내가 신앙을 할 때. That's right for me to live spiritual life. 내 생각만 하지 말고. Don't just think about your thoughts. 하나님의 마음을 알아서. You must know the heart of God. 하나님 어떻게 우리 죄를 사하여 예수님 보내주셨고. How God sent Jesus to forgive your sins. 예수 우리 죄를 십자에 못 박혀 죽으시면서. And through Jesus being crucified for your sins. 우리의 모든 All your sins have been forgiven. That is such accurate truth. So from then on, I believed in Jesus. I said, I am righteous. I am holy. People said, how could you be righteous? You know, you, you're a crook. That's right. I've done bad things. But Jesus was crucified to receive all the punishment for my sins. And all my sins were washed whiter than the snow. So God says in the word that he remembers our sins no more. God says he remembers our sins no more. Then that's right. My sins are forgiven. I used to always say that I'm a sinner. Oh God, thank you. Jesus, you were you were crucified for my sins. Now my sins are washed. I am holy. I am righteous. I was so free and bold and thankful and close with God. Believing in that Jesus and I believe in that God. If God says I'm justified, I am righteous. If Jesus says my sins are forgiven, they are forgiven. What do you believe? Your own heart? No. Believe the Bible. The Bible is the word of God. God says he remembers my sins no more. He says they're all forgiven. And Jairus' daughter was on the verge of death. She died. But Jesus says, she is sleeping. She is sleeping then. She is not dead. But sleeping. She's dead in our eyes. She's dead in our eyes. But what does Jesus say? She is not dead. Sleeping. Then she is sleeping. But people who are in their own thoughts. I saw it. I've done bad things. I've lied. I've stolen. I'm a sinner. That's what they say. But the people who believe in Jesus. I committed sins. That's right. I'm a sinner. But. But Jesus received all the punishment for my sins. I am clean. I am holy. I am righteous. Then I am righteous. That's what it means to believe. Many people today. They don't see what God says about their sins in the Bible. Because it is different from their own judgment. No matter how, how much of a sinner you are in your thoughts. We need to open the Bible and see what it is what God is saying. But people don't look at that. If they think of themselves as sinners. They just think that they're sinners and say that they're sinners. And if they think that they don't have sins, then they say they don't have sins. They just believe their own thoughts. But as we live in this world, God is with us. And God loved us. And sent his only begotten son, Jesus, for our sins. Isn't that amazing? 
How thankful we are for this. Through Jesus being crucified, all of our sins have been forgiven. Therefore, we are sinners in our own eyes. But when he looks at us through the cross, we are not sinners. We have been justified. We are holy. How amazing this is. I can only praise God. So I believe those words. In my eyes, I'm a sinner, but, but if God says I am righteous, I am righteous. After receiving the forgiveness of sins, it does not just end there. I got to know through the Bible that there is the help of God for me. God is with us. And he protects us and he takes care of us. I got to know that he is more than capable of making me clean and holy. And I came to believe in that God from my heart. In my eyes, often I am wrong. And even though I don't want to, I often fall into sin. And when I do a little bit of good, and I sometimes do this much evil, that's how I am. But God is the Almighty God. It is not about believing my thoughts, but believing the words of God. And if the word of God says that I am righteous, then I am righteous. Everyone, if Jesus was crucified for our sins and he shed his blood, if he did not die for our sins, we would all be sinners. But he shed his blood and died for all our sins. But if we say that we're sinners, that would be upsetting to Jesus. I shed my blood and died for you. And I forgave all your sins. And you say that you're a sinner? You're not believing in me. I think that's how it would be. However, Jesus died for our sins. And he washed our sins whiter than the snow. And in the Bible, it tells us that many, many times. He was wounded for our transgressions. And he was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And with his stripes, we are healed. All we like sheep have gone astray. Everyone has turned to his own way. And the Lord hath laid on him, hath laid on Jesus the iniquity of us all. Our sins have been laid on Jesus. Even though they were sins we committed, they've been laid on Jesus. Therefore, Jesus has to be responsible for them. And our sins have all been laid on him. Therefore, for our sins, he shed his blood at the cross and forgive us from all our sins. We should first discover that we have committed sins and we're sinners. And secondly, that's right, we've sinned and we're sinners, but, but what did Jesus do for us? He was crucified and punished for our sins instead of us. Then it's true that I've sinned, but we are not sinners. In many places throughout the Bible, God says he remembers our sins no more, that our sins are forgiven. He tells us so. We're talking about believing in this truth. The blood, the blood of Jesus Christ delivered us out from all sins. And has made us perfect and holy. Even though I have many sins, I believe that by the blood of Jesus my sins are forgiven. Therefore, I give thanks to God. 
붙여놓습니다. In many churches they have the cross. 왜 십자가를 그려놓습니다. Why do they have crosses on high? 십자가 못 빠지고 예수님을 기억해. To remember Jesus who was crucified. 그 죽음으로 우리 죄가 사해졌던 그 이야기인데. It means that he would die for our sins and our sins are forgiven. 십자가 못 빠지 죽기 전에 우리가 죄인이고. But we were sinners before Jesus was crucified. 그러나 내도 죄인이라면. But if we're sinners even after he was crucified. 십자가 못 빠지 죽음이 아무 의미가 없는 것이 되어버립니다. That makes the death of Jesus on the cross pointless. 하나님의 은혜로 우리가 살면서 Even though we live by the grace of God 예수의 피로 말미암아 Through the blood of Jesus Christ 우리가 눈처럼 이게 씻어졌습니다. Our sins have been washed whiter than the snow. 그 저는 그걸 믿었습니다. And that was what I believed. 그때부터 주님하고 나하고 한 마음이 됐습니다. From then on I became one heart with the Lord. 내가 그 전에 알고 있던 지식이나 the 방법을 no- 다 버리고 I threw away the knowledge and all the ways that I had before. 예수님의 말씀을 믿었습니다. And then I believe the words of Jesus. 예수님의 말씀을 믿고 난 뒤에 And after believing the words of Jesus. 내 속에 살아서 일하는 걸볼수 I could see God living and working inside of me. 이제 저는 성경 말씀을 따라서 Now according to the words of the Bible. 내가 죄를 지었지만 Even though I committed sins. 내 십자가에 못 박힌 내 죄를 다 사한 걸 믿습니다. I believe that Jesus was crucified and forgave all my sins. 성경에는 And in other scriptures. 예수 우리 죄를 다시는 기억지 않는다고 말씀. It tells us Jesus remembers our sins no more. 예수님 기억지 않는다. Jesus does not remember them. 기억지 않는 것입니다. That means he does not remember them. 너무 놀랍습니다. It's so amazing. 그때부터 하나님과 나하고 한 마음이 되고 From then on God and I became one heart. 이제 그때부터 하나님 말씀 내 안에 살아 역사하시면서 and from then on the word of god began to live inside of me 인생을 바꾸어 주는 걸 경험할 수가 있었습니다. and i experienced it changing my life 그래서 우리가 주님의 십자가를 찬양하고 that's why we praise 감사를 드린 거죠. we praise the cross of jesus and give thanks to god the living jesus He died for us. He was crucified. And his death on the cross, it was in the place of our sins. Through his death, it is right that our sins have been washed whiter than the snow. Now I am not a sinner. If my son is renting a room in America, if I pay the rent one year's worth for him, for one year he doesn't have to pay rent. If I pay 10 years worth of rent for him, he won't have to pay rent for 10 years. If I buy that house for him, then what would happen? He doesn't have to pay anything. He can just freely live there. We have received such amazing grace and mercy. Just as the house was bought for him, at the cross he delivered us out from all sins. That's why I praise the name of the Lord and give honor and glory to God. From that day on, no matter what I did, Jesus and I were one heart. God helped me and blessed me and I saw him bestowing grace unto me. And with all my heart, I gave thanks to God and I served God and I lived for God. And Jesus was working for me. Through that, my life became changed and blessed. Everyone, if you believe in God, all your problems will be not yours, but the problems of Jesus. And I believe you will gain infinite grace and blessings. Jesus received all the punishment for our sins and delivered us out from sin. Therefore, I give thanks to God. Thank you. Be there where grace abounds more. Pastor Oksu Park's lectures on the Gospel of Mark will continue every Saturday at 9 p.m. Eastern, right here on CTN. For spiritual counseling, visit us at gnmusa.org. Call 1-888-466-9846 for more information.